Hey, how are you doing? Welcome to this video. In this video, I'm gonna change the saddlebags on my motorcycle. But first, let me introduce you to it. Here you see the bags that I'm going to install along with the brackets that support them on the motorcycle. The reason that I'm changing the saddlebags is obvious from this shot. So the first thing I need to do is see how the wires are going because I need to put these further back so there's more room for the bags. wire is stuck here, kept to the side, but I loosened it, now I have to remember where, which one goes, so I think I'm gonna mark them with tape. First I have to remove the old shadow bags and make sure I connect the indicators right and use these to make the wires longer. So I broke this one time. So I ordered the new one. I'm gonna replace that now. Already made it longer. First replace this one with this one. As new. <laughs> so now I'm gonna install the first bracket to support the bigger bags. I didn't have one for the smaller ones because it didn't fit so that went against the suspension. But it's better to have brackets. That's one done. I 
I think this bit is gonna be a little bit tricky. I have to get these off and put the leather of the bags through here and then somehow screw these back on. But I think I have to poke some holes in the leather or something. Let's see how it goes. Rose. making a hole. I've got these cutters that worked better I think. Should have done the other side first because of the exhaust, and I want them to be more or less symmetrical. Here you see me struggling with getting the screws back on. After a while I realized that this was not going to work, so I made a change of plans. I also put on working gloves, because now it was getting serious. Okay, so when the two pieces, a piece of the bag go on top of each other, the bolts won't go in that well. So now I'm gonna cut off a small part of the saddlebag so they fit there and it's only one layer instead of two. At this point you would think I was done, but I decided there was even a better way to attach it. Learning by doing, I guess. However, this was going to be a bit annoying to do, but the end result would be better. But hey, who takes the easy route if you can do it the hard way? The annoying part was that I had to take off the nuts and bolts of the sissy bar. This doesn't sound too bad, but the nut goes in the tube of the chassis, so it's a pain to get them on again.
Now I just had to reattach the bolts from the rear fender and further secure the bags with tie rips. I decided not to use the ropes that came with the bags because tie rips are easier and should do the job just fine. So now I'm just putting back on the saddles. Finally all done. Here's the end result. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video, if you did make sure to like and subscribe and hopefully I'll see you back in the next video.